fifth race. The free-for-all pacing field at the start. And they're off. Admiral's Express chugs out of there. Going with him in the middle of the track is Judge Cam. Along their inside, Moxie has taken position. McDillon charges out into the top four out at the grandstand side. All-Star Blue Jeans sent through in fifth. Daylon Trooper is sixth away. Ewell Star looking for a seat from seventh. I'm Canadian now is eighth. All-American Theory is ninth. La Cucarocha, tenth and last away. Admiral's Express on the inside. McDillon driving up. The quarter was 25 seconds even. McDillon has made the lead, winning the first turn sprint. Admiral's Express races along in second. Moxie is third over to the back stretch, and Judge Cam sits fourth. All Star Blue Jean fifth on the way to the half. Daylon Trooper sits on the inside from six. Yule Star is seventh. I'm Canadian now eighth. All American Theory ninth and being brought to the outside. Two more lengths back to La Cucarocha. And it's Moxie moving. Moxie, second quarter move on McDillon. Admiral's Express third. Moxie up to take over. 54 seconds. Moxie, the new leader from McDillon. Admiral's Express back. Back along the inside is third and Judge Cam fourth, and he's considering coming out. All-star Blue Jean commits to the outside from fifth. There goes Daylon Trooper. He's third over in sixth position. Yule Star shoots the gap, but is going to run into a blind switch from seventh. Thumb Canadian now eighth on the outside. All-American Theory, two more lengths from ninth. La Cucarocha tenth. It's Moxie at the head of the stretch. McDillon is still dogging him. Admiral's Express is third, turning for home. 121 and three, 27 and three, third quarter. Mike. Saftig and Moxie trying to seal this victory an eighth of a mile away and here comes Admiral's Express from the inside ride in the three hole. Admiral's Express on the outside. The Grey Gladiator slays them again. Admiral's Express, his unbelievable run continues. He defeated Mick Dillon, then back to Judge Cam Moxie alongside Yule Star. Admiral's Express, 148 and 4, just missing the track record by a fifth of a second. Now declared the official winner of the fifth race, number six, Admiral's Express. The Admiral's Galley, gray eight-year-old gelding from Platinum Card. Owned by Laurel and Gary Gus, Cheryl and Ed Safier of Rockford, Michigan. Trained by Mike Hales and driven to victory by Paul McDonnell. His fourth in 19 this year on the circuit where he became a racing millionaire and the great lifelong legend of the great gladiator grows again on cup 21 eliminations night 148 and four just missing the track record by a fifth of a second shaving a full second off his own life's mark was admiral's express out trackside to make a beautiful blanket presentation to admiral's express members of the molson incorporated group party